Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel and welcome back for another video. With Easter right around the corner, I thought it was only right that I share with you how to make the perfect hard-boiled egg. First things first, you want to grab a pot and add some water to it. Now, how much water just depends on how many eggs you're making. Just add enough so that your eggs submerge underneath the water. Then you're going to turn your heat to about a medium, medium high, and add a heavy pinch of salt to your water along with a lid. This just allows the boiling process to go a lot faster. Once your water has come to a boil, you can go ahead and slowly add those eggs into that water. Take your time with this because the last thing you want is to end up with a cracked egg or two in that water. It just won't look as good. Once your eggs are added into that water, set your timer for 14 minutes. Do not skip this step. Leave them uncovered and let them boil. After the 14 minutes has come to an end, you're going to go ahead, turn that timer off, and turn the heat off. Immediately, you're going to take those eggs and add them into an ice water bath. This will stop the cooking process and it'll also allow it to be easier for you to manage when you want to go ahead and peel it. Now I've found that peeling your eggs when they're still just a little warm does make it easier. And as you can see here, I did tap the bottom portion of my egg first and I rolled it against my paper towel. This makes for an easier peel. If you look at how I'm peeling my egg here, the shell kind of just comes right off with ease. The egg is still in place and it looks good. So I'm just going to dip the egg right back into that ice water bath and set it off to the side in another bowl. Beautiful. I'm just going to continue doing this process for the rest of my eggs, tapping it at the bottom, giving it a nice roll and peeling that shell right away. But I have a question for you. During Easter, I know it's kind of like a tradition to boil eggs and dye them. But does anyone ever eat their eggs? <laughs> I am one of those people who will boil the eggs just for the experience, just to say we did it. But I never really eat them. I'm just going to be honest. Um, I've gotten to, into the habit of only boiling maybe six eggs, a carton of six eggs. And instead of doing the entire dozen, because I just feel like they're a waste. It's a waste. And honestly, it's a little bit harder to peel cold eggs than it is to peel freshly boiled eggs. But yeah, we made it to the end of cracking all of those eggs. They are nice and beautiful. Look at that. Mm. So I'm just going to go ahead and discard of those shells. Peeling it over a napkin definitely helps with that cleanup process. And yeah. Of course, it's only right that I go ahead and split one open for you so you can see the inside of the egg. I know a lot of the times we have trouble with boiling those eggs, um, with overdoing our eggs, because there's still some green in that yolk, or there is green in the yolk. But as you can see here, these eggs are beautifully done, perfectly done, a nice hard boil without feeling like they're overcooked. I just went in with some seasoning, salt, and black pepper because I'm going to eat one here. And look at that. Mm, nice and beautiful. But if this has helped you, let me know down in the comments below. Bye, y'all.